Hey guys, and welcome to my world. So, continuing the theme of Comic-Con trailers and reactions, uh, I've just finished reacting to three DC trailers I have reacted to. <laughs> Anyways, I have reacted to the Lego Batman movie Comic-Con trailer. Uh, I'll link it all up here or in the description below. I have reacted to the Justice League Comic-Con trailer where I do talk about the Wonder Woman trailer as well. Um, and yeah, I have reacted to season three of The Flash, the first look from Comic-Con. Check those reactions out. I'll link them in the description below as well. But anyways, there was a um, Suicide Squad Comic-Con trailer as well, but I'm not watching it. I don't want to see too much of that film because I am slightly excited about it, intrigued about it. So yeah, that is a DC film I am actually looking forward to in a way. Uh, I will be seeing that, so hit subscribe if you want to stay tuned for my thoughts and reviews of that next month. But yeah, moving on to Marvel. Now guys, you know I love Marvel. You know it. I absolutely love Marvel with a passion. The MCU, in my op opinion, is greatness. It really is. I am so hyped about freaking Guardians of the Galaxy 2. I am so hyped about Captain Marvel. I am so hyped about Thor Ragnarok. Guys, there was leaked images of freaking Gladiator Hulk. There was concept art from Spider-Man Homecoming of the Vulture. There was news of Brie Larson being, <laughs> being confirmed as Captain Marvel. I am so so hyped, <laughs> so hyped, like, oh, oh. <laughs> guys, <laughs> seriously, I need to calm down, <laughs> guys, when I talk Thor Ragnarok, like, I am so hoping Thanos shows up and just wrecks shit, because, right, this is what I need to talk about before I react to Doctor Strange official trailer, I just need to get this out, I've seen the title, the title image of Thor Ragnarok and I don't like it. I do not like it. I much preferred the Asgardian stone one that was out before. This one looks like an old Nintendo futuristic game sort of thing. Not liking it and it has made me very, very wary because Ragnarok is either the apocalypse or... A freaking robot Thor that Iron Man made. Now, I was hoping it was the apocalypse, the end of Asgard, Thanos shows up, just wrecks shit. You know, Hulk comes running at, running at him in his gladiator armour and Thanos just stops him dead and beats the shit out of him. That is what I want Ragnarok to be. But with this new title, I am really hoping they don't have a freaking robot Thor. Like... That's what I'm getting from the title, and I'm hoping that's not the case, because I don't want that. If there's going to be another Thor, please throw Beta Ray Bill in there or something. Like, <laughs> not a robot Thor. I'm very, very wary now. Yes, I never thought I'd turn around and say I didn't like something released from Marvel. But yeah, not looking forward to that if that happens. But yeah, the next film we have out is Doctor Strange. And I have reacted to the first trailer. If you want to see that, I'll link it here on the description below. But we have, we have the Comic-Con trailer. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. And I am about to react to it. Are you ready? Are you ready? Let's full screen this. Let's get Cumberbatched. Oh, that was a nice car. What if I told you the reality you know is one of many? Oh, shit. This doesn't make any sense. Not everything does. Not everything has to. Oh, nice. No, like one of those things that you look through, you twist. Oh. The ancient one. Oh, it's like Inception, man. <laughs> it's proper fucking with my eyes. How do I get 
This looks beautifully shot, man. Churatel Ejiofor. Cumberbatch has been in the gym. Wouldn't be a superhero trailer. There wasn't a topless scene. Mads Mikkelsen. He's he has brought Inception over, man. This looks so damn good. Holy shit. Man, he is the Sorcerer Supreme! <laughs> Doctor Strange. Oh. Shambhala. <laughs> We're not savages. Oh. <laughs> the freaking Wi-Fi password. <laughs> that is a line you end a trailer on. Not, not. I hear you talk to fish. Oh, Marvel, you done it again. You, you gone done did it. <laughs> Oh. oh, guys, I am so looking forward to Doctor Strange. Now, I am not a big fan of Doctor Strange. I haven't read any of his comics, his storylines. I know very little about him. I know him from uh, the animated movie. I know him from games. And I know him from, what is it Harry watched? Superhero Friends or something? That kid's Marvel thing? That was quite fun. That was a lot of fun, yeah. Superhero Squad or something, wasn't it? Yeah, that was good. And I know him from that. Um, <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I'm not a big know-it-all on Doctor Strange, but that movie looks so damn good. It looks so beautifully shot. Just the imagery looks so damn good. Proper fucks with your eyes, though. It's like being... It, it, I, I've never done drugs in my life. But I think I know what it's like to be on acid now. <laughs> it looks so cool. Um, the whole magic element of it. The, the runes in his hands. The spells. It all looks awesome to me. I am so hyped to see it this year. Cannot wait. Oh, I'm going to be seeing it day of release like I do with every Marvel film. So make sure you hit subscribe. Stay tuned for my movie review if you want to see that. Um, oh yeah guys have you seen this trailer what did you think of it let me know down in the comment section below uh, what did you think of the Marvel panel overall the news of Brie Larson being uh, announced as Captain Marvel freaking Kurt Russell being the living planet Ego and Star-Lord's father like is, he, is that one person or is that saying he's two characters because like if Star-Lord's dad's a living planet, then his mum is loose. <laughs> his mum is loose. <laughs> was that too soon? <laughs> I feel like that was too soon. <laughs> I'm hoping, I'm hoping Kurt Russell was two different characters there. Like, I don't want Star-Lord's dad being a planet. <laughs> the way it's written, it sounds like they could be the same person. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I have seen the Guardian's image as well with little Gru. He looks super cool. Um, yeah, we've got Nebula in there as well. And, oh, what's her name? Mantis? Is it Mantis? Pretty sure it's Mantis. They're bringing her into it, which is awesome. And Yondu is in there as well. Fondu with Yondu. I absolutely love Michael Rooker. He is awesome. Loved him in Guardians number one. Cannot wait for Guardians number two. The awesome mix. Volume two. Please be freaking epic like the first one. <laughs> yes, so much good news from Marvel uh, so far. Uh, 
like I said, I was a bit let down with the Thor Ragnarok title, hoping they don't go the robot route, hoping they keep it with Asgardian uh, Apocalypse, but the title does not look good to me. It looks like Nintendo game. <laughs> it does. <laughs> it does. Um, and yeah, we had concept art from Spider-Man Homecoming as well, which looked absolutely epic. Lots of stuff from Marvel. Uh, X-Men, was there... X-Men TV series as well coming out, Legion as well, I think there's a trailer of that so I might be reacting to that as well, if you want to see that, hit subscribe down below and stay tuned for that, but yeah, that is my thoughts on the Marvel panels, the Marvel uh, news and the Doctor Strange Comic Con trailer, guys, as always, thanks for watching and take care. See you later! Guys, you made it to the end of the video. Thank you for watching. If you want to stay up to date with content from me, then click subscribe here. I've linked a few other videos here for your entertainment. If you want to check those out, just click on the image shown. If not, look over my channel. I'm sure there's some other content you'll enjoy. Thanks for watching, guys. And as always, take care.